This is the Bare Essentials of Concrete, a series created to help people that work in the construction sector better understand the theory which governs how concrete behaves and how we use it in construction. Asking the questions for you is this group of people who are either construction professionals or people who are studying construction. And answering the questions will be Professor Nick Bernfeldt of Imperial College London. Concrete is the world's most heavily consumed material. Eight billion cubic metres of concrete are poured each year. That's equivalent to more than one cubic metre per person on the planet every year. Concrete is made from three principal ingredients, from cement, aggregate and water. And those materials are mixed together to produce a liquid that can be poured into almost any shape and with time turns into a rock-like material. So why is concrete so popular? Concrete is popular for many reasons. First, the materials used to make concrete are readily available anywhere in the world. Next, concrete is a low technology system. Complicated equipment isn't required. Concrete structures can be formed to any scale from a paving slab right up to a massive hydroelectric dam. And concrete can be poured into any shape. So depending on the mixture of cement, aggregate and water we use, we can produce materials with very different properties. Concrete is usually strong in compression and stiff, but it's weak in tension. And we can get over that by reinforcing it, usually with steel, to produce a material that is both strong in compression and tension. Finally, concrete is durable in a wide range of environments, not just the buildings we live in, but in nuclear power stations, in offshore structures, in high temperature furnaces. These are the reasons why concrete is so popular. Has concrete been around for a long time? Well, you might think of concrete as a modern material, but in fact it's been used for thousands of years. Perhaps the most famous example of its use from the ancient world was the domed roof of the Pantheon in Rome, a 43-metre diameter, unreinforced concrete dome that is today in perfect condition and is probably stronger now than it's ever been. The use of concrete really picked up around 100 years ago when steel reinforcing rods became available. And that meant that concrete beams could be produced that would span farther than timber and were also more fire resistant.